everyone, I am Nupur from Blue Circle Libraries Foundation um, and today's video is going to be about how to apply an infusion set with an insulin pump. Um, so Blue Circle Libraries Foundation is a uh, non-profit and a support group for people living with all types of diabetes in India. You will find us on uh, Facebook. Our community is called Diabetes Support Network India. You will find us on Instagram, Twitter, Clubhouse. In fact, um, quickly take a look at all our links in the YouTube description box and you will find us on all social media. Um, now that I have that out of the way, let me come back um, and tell you about how to change your patch if you wear a, an insulin pump. Um, so. A lot of people have been asking us, um, you know, what an insulin pump is, how it looks, um, how it works, and here's a quick and a small tutorial on how to change your patch. But before I um, move on and tell you more about that, let me also quickly show you the three ways in which you can deliver insulin, three modes of delivery. Um, this is the first one. This is a syringe. Um, uh, and it's it's old school, it's cheap, um, I've used it for over 20 years and it works brilliantly. Uh, so that's a syringe, this is an insulin pen. Um, insulin pens and syringes do the same job which is deliver insulin. Um, you can also see these cute little stickers here that show you, um, you know, it's this one says long acting insulin and this one says short acting insulin. Um, you'll find these stickers on the Blue Circle store on our website and uh, don't be silly and put the long acting and the short acting on the same pen like I did. The third mode of insulin delivery is an insulin pump. Um, this is my insulin pump. I'm using a Medtronic 722. Um, you'll find various models and we're not going to get into um, you know the features of, of different models and which models there are. Uh, but this is what a pump looks like. This is what one type of pump looks like. It's a machine that delivers insulin. It's a mode of insulin delivery, just like the syringe and the insulin pen. So uh, here's this machine, here's a tube that connects to a patch on your body, um, a patch that you have to inject onto your body and change every three days. So now I'm gonna show you what goes into changing a patch. So these are the things you need to change your patch or your infusion set. This is the infusion set or the patch that's going to go on your body. You're going to have to inject this. This device right here is called a serter. You're going to fix the patch into the serter. Uh, this of course is my insulin. You can use a cartridge or vial, whatever um, appeals to you. And this thing right here is called a reservoir. So these two are the consumables. All right, so how it works is that uh, this patch uh, is injected into your body. I'm going to inject it into my torso. Uh, there's a filament that stays in your body. Um, so in my case, I use the um, 9 mm uh, infusion set. So a 9 mm plastic filament will stay inside my body and deliver the insulin. There's also a tube attached um, to this infusion set. Um, and then this goes into the reservoir which goes in your pump. Uh, this is the reservoir that contains the insulin that your pump delivers. So what I'm going to do next is I'm going to open this packet up. I'm going to open it up and I'm going to fit it into this serter. Um, it's pretty simple to do that. You can just, this is what the patch looks like. The blue part you, you see here is where the needle is. So you um, fix it into the serter, you align it like this and you push it in a little bit. Um, you'll see a paper cover, you'll see a sticker on the top and you need to remove that sticker and then you can pull it in like this and take off the covering. So now you can see the needle uh, which will go into my body. There's a little paper clip here that you need to remove. So I'm going to do that. And uh, you need to make sure that the area that you apply your patch on is clean and uh, wiped down with uh, alcohol or spirit. So I'm going to stand up. I'm going to, um, now I've already cleaned my, um, my site, which is going to be my torso. I'm going to apply this um, 
onto my torso very quickly. Um, so here's my patch. You can see my patch right here. I'm gonna apply it on my body like this. I don't know if you heard that, but a little um, noise that indicates your patch is applied. You push this down and then you remove it. Okay, and now uh, the blue part that you see is a retractable needle that comes out. So I'm gonna hold this like this and I'm gonna pull out the needle. There you go. I'm not sure if you can see it, but this is the needle. You um, close this and you keep it aside to dispose and then you, you take this off so this is the tubing um, that will be used to deliver the insulin into my body. Um, after that, I'm going to take out my, uh, my patch, my, my existing patch and okay so this is my pump and this is um, the tubing, the previous one that I used. Okay, uh, so with the pump on one side is your reservoir, on the other side is your battery. Um, so take out your previous reservoir, this is what the reservoir looks like. Um, and then you're going to have to rewind your pump. Um, so there's a little piston in here, you probably can't see it, but there's a piston in here that needs to go all the way back. Um, so you need to go into your pump and um, re rewind it. And in my pump, I find that under the prime option. So you go to prime and then you say rewind and then you can hear a little mechanical whirring sound um, that rewinds this pump. What you need to do after that is um, take a new reservoir, a new packet right here and um, you need to open it up. So I've opened it up right here and you need to fill this with insulin and this is then what goes into your pump and you um, are then ready to go. So what I'm going to do now is I already have some insulin in my previous reservoir that I don't want to waste. Of course, insulin is incredibly expensive. Um, so I'm going to use that. Um, I'm going to use my reservoir to pull out the existing insulin out of my previous reservoir. So I'm going to just pull it this way. I'm going to draw it into the um, new reservoir. And there you go. I've used every last drop of insulin. Um, I keep it aside. And now I, I take my vial of insulin. I use um, Nuvo Rapid. So, so this is my vial. You can use a vial or a cartridge. Um, I use a vial because it's, it's cheaper. Um, so now you fix this in here and you draw um, the insulin that you'd need for about three days and probably a little bit more um, to cover you in case of any um, additional requirements. You could be, you could be unwell, you could um, have eaten a big meal and need more insulin. So keep some extra insulin for that. Ensure that you don't have any bubbles. So, um, you know, you can take the top off to take a quick look. You can turn it around and it seems like I am good to go. I'm all set. So here's my, um, here's my reservoir and uh, I'm going to push out a, a small drop of insulin. I'm going to take this off the top and the bottom both. And then this reservoir is going to go in to my insulin pump. All right, so this is the tubing and the tubing has two ends and you can see which one I need to fix on my reservoir. So I'm going to use this end, uh, plug it into the reservoir. It has a little needle that goes right into the reservoir. And then I'm going to take my pump and I'm going to put uh, the reservoir into place. And um, I have already rewound it, so that's, that part's done. I'm fixing it in now. It's fixed in. You can feel a little resistance when it's done. And then you go to your pump. Um, on the screen, you press Act and you do something called priming, uh, which I think is a word that you might be familiar with. So you press the Act button. In my case, I press the Act button uh, for this model of pump and I prime it. 
Um, and how do you know it's done? So when you prime it, you want a little bit of insulin to come out to be, to be sure that the insulin is um, flowing smoothly through this um, tube right here. So I am priming it and as soon as I see a little drop that comes out here, I will stop priming it. There you go. Um, you can see the little drop of insulin there. So that's a little bit of insulin, about five units uh, that I need. And then you're gonna put this, um, you're gonna put this um, a tube, you're gonna connect it to your infusion set, which you just injected. Um, so I'm going to now apply this here. You can see, um, you know, you can see these blue lines. So you, you fix it in like that, and then you um, just click it into place, and now you're ready. Okay, so um, you go back to your pump and you do something called fixed prime. Um, so the meaning of fixed prime is that you also prime your cannula. There are two parts that you need to prime. One is this is this tubing right here and the second is the cannula that stays, the filament that stays inside your body. So both of these need to be primed before you can use your pump. So um, I hope you guys found this useful and if you have any questions for me, um, about the insulin pump or how to apply it, uh, feel free to write them down in the comments below and um, do like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you very much for watching. Bye.